Hey Aries, it's about that time for y'all love reading. Happy Aries season. Happy birthday if this month is your birthday or next month is your birthday, whether it passed, whether it's coming up, whatever the case may be. Happy birthday to you. I'm currently shuffling this deck, my oracle deck that I created. You can buy it in the description box. Um, I'll have my link right there. If you see the smoke, that's from my incense. How to cleanse the decks. I did a deal today. It was what what's their current feelings for 555 on Wednesdays. That's the deal. What's their current feelings for 555? So make sure I follow my Instagram down below. It'll also be in the description box so you could, you know, um, stay in tune with the deals that I do or the giveaways or the raffles. I will be doing a raffle soon enough. So once again, make sure y'all tap into that. Alrighty, so Aries. We're going to see what's going on with you. I'm going to start off with what is going on in your love life. What is going on in Aries' love life? Ooh. Okay. Okay, Aries. So, Knight of Wands came out with the Seven of Cups. So, I see that you have a lot of options. I see that people is making their way towards you. Um, I see that you have a lot of options, a lot of admirers. Um, so, you know, if you want, go ahead and pursue those options. But I definitely see that there's options for you there's people that want you multiple people not just one or two no multiple so what i'm gonna do is see what's your person's feelings for you what's your feelings for them what's the outcome and what is it that you two want to say to each other but don't feel comfortable sharing so aries how does your person currently feel about you how does your person currently feel about you? They feel like things are moving slow between y'all. They feel they definitely feel like things are moving slow between y'all. The Knight of Pentacles came out. The Hierophant reverse. You could be dealing with the Taurus. So your person feels as if things are moving very, very slow between y'all. Um, it's like they're not getting what they want out of you. Whether it be a relationship or um, a family or something. Whatever it is that they want. They see that they're not getting it out of you. With the Ace of Swords, I see that they communicate with what they want. They communicate about it. They let it be known. But with the Hierophant Reverse, it looks like you two don't want the same thing. How else do they feel about the Aries? So, the first card, using my oracle deck, I wish I had treated you better. This is the Mass Feelings Oracle COVID-19 edition. So, your person wished that they have treated you better. They wish they treated you better. They wish that they um, spoke to you better. Even with the Ace of Swords, it could be that maybe they were very um, disrespectful with how they speak to you. And they wish that they weren't. You're the closest person to me. Your person feels as if you're the closest person to them that you really understand them that they can really count on you and they see you as the one who has got away so it's either they see you as someone who's gotten away from them or someone who is slowly slipping away from them so they feel as if if they don't get their shit together or if they don't you know lock you down hold you down that it's going to be a missed opportunity it's going to be a missed um yeah i guess you can say a missed opportunity it's like they're going to feel like you are the one that got away Alrighty, so Aries, how do you feel about your person? Too many cards just flipped over. Okay. Aries, how do you feel about your person? Sheesh. I see you got a lot of feelings or something because sheesh. Aries, how do you feel about your person? You're trying to trust your intuition on something. You're trying to trust yourself on something four cards came out so i'm gonna grab them all i see that you still have love for your person you have a lot of love for them you do have options and you know that you have options and considering that the relationship seems a little rocky not to say that you're pursuing those options but i definitely see that it's a thought in your mind it's a thought in your mind to pursue those other options but right now i see that you're trying to trust your gut instinct with the high priestess you're trying to trust your gut instinct you're trying to trust yourself um but yeah i definitely see 
Seven of Pentacles came out. So Seven of Cups came out first about, you know, seeing um, what's going on with you, with your love life. And then the Seven of Pentacles came out in your spread about how you feel about your person. So although it's how you feel about your person, I see that it's how you feel in general. And you definitely do have options. Um, you definitely do love your person. But due to things being rocky, due to, due to things being, you know, a little iffy, you're thinking about pursuing those options. For some of y'all, y'all already are. For others, you're thinking about it. How else does Aries feel about their person? How else does Aries feel about the person they are dealing with? So this could be someone that you're separated from. It doesn't have to be an actual breakup. It could just be a little break. But the first card that came out is I had to mask my feelings from you. So you feel like you had to mask your feelings from them. You feel like, yeah, I have a lot of love for this person. Yeah, I love this person, but I can't let them know or I can't really let it be shown. Like maybe you're afraid of being vulnerable or you're afraid of being taken advantage for showing vulnerability i miss sleeping with you came out you miss sleeping with your person you miss cuddling them you miss their body warmth their body heat you miss you know the intimacy of cuddling and then i know i messed everything up so you know the 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 how can you say it you know what you did to you know how can i say it goodness gracious you know the part that you played pretty much you know the part that you played you know that you know certain things that you said or did mess things up in the connection i don't think you messed everything up but i definitely see that you may feel guilty for things um that's why that card came out you could feel guilty for things that you said and did or you just know the things that you said or did was just a little um messed up so what's the outcome between you and this person You could be dealing with a Sagittarius, another fire sign. Okay. The outcome with this person, I see that you may speak about moving on from them. You may speak to them about moving on. I feel like if you do though, it's not gonna be ASAP. You're gonna take your time bringing that up because you feel as if they're gonna overreact. But I definitely do see that um, you're thinking about moving on or you already have. But with the two of wands, you're still indecisive on if you should. If you did already, then you're indecisive on if you made the right decision doing that. But I definitely see that um, you're indecisive on moving on. You could be dealing with another Aries. Let me get a clarification on the magician. Okay. Five of Cups. I see that this is bothering. It's going to bother you. This whole situation with this person is going to bother the shit out of you. It's going to have you stressing. It's definitely gonna have you stressing you may overreact about it you may um act out of line about it not towards them but towards yourself like you may be you know in bed dwelling on it in bed stressing it in bed you know feeling some type of way just really dwelling on it like sitting in sorrow basically um but i definitely see that yes yeah, like i feel like soon enough it's going to be the only thing that's on your mind like how the connection ended or what happened in the connection it's going to be all that's on your mind like it's going to be heavy on your mind okay let's see what is it that you two want to say to each other but don't feel comfortable sharing okay let's see what is it that you two want to say to each other that you just don't feel comfortable sharing oh well three cards came out already so i'm gonna take those they all came out together so the first card is you were an angel to me so you two feel like you you guys really helped each other at one point at one point it was like things were great you felt like it was meant to be you felt like this person was an angel in your life and your person also feels like you were an angel in their life aries i keep watching your social media you two are watching each other's social media whether it be through your personal accounts a burner account a fake account a friend's account a sister's or brother's account like your page is being watched you two are watching each other's pages and then i want to apologize to you you two want to apologize to each other but y'all don't really um i see hmm let me get clarification on I want to apologize. You two want to apologize to each other. I feel like Aries, your person tends to like type up an apology, but then erase it. It's like, okay, let me not send it. Yeah, yeah. I see it coming soon. Ace of Pentacles, it's definitely going to come soon. Your person may let you know that they want a fresh start with you. 
ace of pentacles the sun you could be dealing with the leo and the page of wands yeah your person wants a fresh start with you your person wants to try again but with the page of wands reversed they feel as if you may reject them at the bottom of the deck is the ten of pentacles your person wants to get back together your person wants to be with you definitely i feel like your person tends to type up a paragraph you know apologizing or trying to give some type of closure or clarity but then they end up erasing it or they end up deleting it so i wouldn't be surprised if they reach out with an apology to you um i'm gonna try something different i got some charms i got a few charms so let's see i'm gonna choose two. Oh, three came out okay so two that came out is a key if y'all can see let me hold it like this it's a key let me show y'all better yeah a key another key so you two see i have a lock in there but the lock didn't come out it's two keys so i see hmm two keys right and then a dragonfly dragonfly represents transformation So two keys and a dragonfly. Honestly, I see that you two want to transform like the whole connection. Like you two want to change the connection for the better. It's like, okay, you two feel as if y'all have the key to each other's hearts. Or it's like, yeah, y'all have the key to each other's hearts, but the key ain't working that's that's literally what i'm hearing like yeah i feel like i have the key to your heart but that key ain't working that key ain't really doing nothing so it's like you two have either the keys to each other's hearts or the key to your own heart and it's like y'all guarding it but y'all don't want to do that y'all want to change the the connection y'all want to change the bond for the better that's what i see honestly It's like, it's either you two are guarding the key to your heart or you two have the key to each other's hearts, but it's hard to get to each other. It's hard to, you know, understand each other. It's like, it's like, it's hard to understand each other. I feel like it's too much confusion here. Too much confusion. That's that's what I'm feeling from these um, charms. I feel pure confusion. I see that you two want to better the connection, you know, transform into a family or, you know, having a home together and this and that. But I don't know. It's like somebody here is very guarded. I'm not too sure if it's the Aries or your person Aries, but someone here is very guarded and that's preventing the change in the connection. That's definitely preventing the change in the connection. Let me throw these back in here. But at the bottom of the deck, remember I said that, you know, your person wants to apologize to you. I feel like they tend to type up paragraphs, you know, typing up an apology, but ending up <clears throat> ending up deleting it. Sorry, that smoke hit me. But at the bottom of the deck is I wish I could take back my words. I'm telling you, your person is going to reach out to you apologizing soon enough. They're going to reach out apologizing. They're going to reach out maybe even spilling your heart out to be honest but i hope you guys enjoyed this reading once again you can buy these oracle decks in the link in my bio i also have healing crystals there um and you can also book your personal readings there that's what i forgot to tell y'all at first the personal readings was only available to book through my instagram you would have to dm me personally but now you can book through the link in the description box my website and um I can send it, you can add your phone number or your social media handle so I can send it through that or I can email you the reading. Um, usually what I do is I take a picture of the spread and then email what I see, what I feel, all of that good stuff. So make sure y'all check that out. But thank you for watching you guys. Um, make sure y'all like this video, make sure y'all subscribe. I have a what's their current feelings reading and for the ones that's in separation, I also have an all signs 
um, love message for the ones that's in separation. So make sure y'all check that out. The next video that will be uploaded will be Taurus. So if you have Taurus placements or you know a Taurus or you're dealing with a Taurus, make sure you know you share that video, watch that video, like that video, all of that good stuff. But thank you for watching, you guys. Bye.